<laughs> What's up, all my early birds? Who's here? Amanda, Matt, Anjo, Christy, and Tommy. Oh, my Lord. Dang. What's we're, going on, people? We were pretty much on time today. Yeah, pretty, pretty much. much. <laughs> Amanda only had four low dollar ones sales today. More than we had. Yeah, Matt said better than no dollar ones. That's true. Oh, we sold two things. So that's good. You're trying to list an alternator, like for a car, Amanda? And Christy found a $50 Stanley mug on Mercari. Mm -hmm. Sold. Sold it. Sold it, yeah. And people, okay, so someone just paid for the Anfontaine. Okay, all right. We're actually getting things paid. eBay must have sent out emails or whatever. Because, okay. I sold three Anne Fontaine things today. Two of them just got paid for. It's nice. Fun. Nicely done. And then we sold a stereo. A stereo? A boombox. Really? <laughs> Which one? <laughs> what? Sony Radio Cassette Recorder Mega Bass. Oh, my God. Jeez, <laughs> it's going to Miami. We're going to have to pack it up. Oh, no, that's that's not so bad. It's like this big. Yeah, but it's still kind of bad. Yeah, it's not so bad. We don't like the pack of It's only like, it's like a, this big one. Hold the bubble wrap. That'll be all right. Mm, I don't like to pack them up. I don't want to list it, but I, this is the motto that we have in this whole chat and group. But, know you know, right? I, you know, I don't know. Like, yeah, either list it local or... I mean, for a Mustang, I'm sure that's a pretty. There's plenty of them. In plenty of them. You you'd have no problem selling it, I would imagine. You should put it in the Facebook group. The guy on the skis. Man, not for us, Tommy. Not today. We had two, one Chris one sale. The server. He had a good server for like five days in a row. One one on uh, on eBay today. This is slowest day on eBay since ever. Since like a year or two. Yeah, it's been rough. Just looking. The day's not over, but all day today we sold one twelve dollar calculator. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, take that. <laughs> uh, is there a worst day on eBay like in seriously two years? Okay. We haven't had a zero dollar eBay so I'm not going with it in two years. And today almost happened. Almost. Twelve dollars, baby. <laughs> You're telling me there's a chance. That's exactly right. How do you get that smell? There's a smell? They have like smoke or something. Oh no. Oh, <laughs> oh god. James said today is trash here. James, we need to talk about your health. Did you go to the doctor? Yeah, man. I read your post. That's scary. Did you go? I'm in. <laughs> <laughs> go to the doctor. He's going to come track you down and make you go. And show up on your doorstep. All right, we're going. Let's go. Oh, my God. Don't laugh out loud at this. You need to go to the freaking doctor and get a freaking blood take draw thing <laughs> work up you need a work full, up the full work up all the things prime running shoe shoe new year resolution a lot of yours all about getting in shape time yeah six 1k days out of seven man god i'm in would you i know right salt in the wound 12 dollar calculators over here please. right <laughs> Twelve-dollar calculator. We're gonna we're gonna flip that upside down in a second. That's exactly right. We're <clears throat> gonna be in Valentine's wear your good outfit days here soon. All right, we're gonna we're gonna continue. I'm supposed to. Yeah, go over. To oh the... wait. Mm. Yeah, it's. Not nice. Not not nice. 
not the good kind of soup. You know, sometimes it can smell like soup in a good way. It smells like the soup you done already ate. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! Oh, no. <laughs> Your hair is all around today. Well, okay. How are you feeling though? That's the bigger question. Are you feeling any better? You want me to get a candle? <laughs> I mean, it's kind of a small space for a candle. Especially the ones we got. They're strong. Yeah, I don't want to smell the clothes, but is the soup smelling at the bowl? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, we're listing with the times. We just need to keep on listing. Oh, man. All my sweaters on. I got like 14 clothes on. It's cold, cold here. Freezing. It's so cold inside the house. Okay, we're gonna get it done. What is this? Where, can you turn on the computer? What are we doing? I can turn on, on the computer. I need a coffee. I need all, but I wish I had some pumpkin pie. Computer's on. And a coffee right now. All right, what is this? These are some more pants, but these are from Escada. These are virtual wool. They are like trousers, like gray pants. Gray. Um, they are not lined. Size 40. I don't know what else I can tell you. All right, let's go. They got pleats. They got mm -hmm. pockets. I right. wish I had chocolate or coffee or like warm dove. So the brave little toaster VHS. Oh, I oh, love the I brave remember. little toaster. Freaking remember that movie. That takes me way back. <clears throat> I'm glad you smell better. I don't, even have my, I don't even have my front light. What's going on here? Set it next to you. No, don't burn it. Maybe that'll work. No. Just light one wick of the three. <laughs> Never do that. <clears throat> Battery's on a hundred percent tonight. Oh, somebody came prepared. All right. Looks at a pair of pre owned on cloud today, sold in 20 minutes, $130 shipped. Yes. Maybe they were out of stock other places, you know? That's amazing. Size 40 is. Ten. 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 <laughs> Getting started early. <laughs> oh, okay. I'm dying right now. All right. Okay. All right. What's the number? <laughs> uh, seven, one, eight, three. All right. I'm going to get the candle. All right. Oh, should we get a different one or the same one off the wall? Whatever. whatever. We got the, we got the one off the wall. Too. No, it's too strong. I'll get the coffee one off. Okay. Yeah. But then you're going to want me to make you a coffee. <laughs> Dang it. That's how this works, you see. What's the over-under on how much time before <laughs> I get asked to go make a coffee as soon as the candle arrives? <clears throat> I'm 
Ralph Lauren jeans for 150 bucks. Nice. Which label? I'm just curious. <laughs> no, I hear you. I mean, you can't focus on anything else. You're just constantly distracted about <clears throat> well, whatever it is that's bothering you. you get it. <laughs> Even coming back here, it's like, well, 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 yeah. Ralph Lauren jeans for like 150. His stuff is always a buy when I see it. Just like regular or Ralph Lauren. That's what I asked. I asked what label. Not having a comfortable replace is terrible. It's okay. I'm not sure. Um, what about the smell? And, huh? you, and he's talking about the smell and you having to go get the candle and fix it. Oh, that's horrible. <clears throat> All right. We're going to try this over here. Normal polo distressed jeans. Okay. What's up, Ken? I don't think we pick up that much polo. Just like regular old blue tag. Polo, I mean, I've, polo. we haven't had much luck, but then again, we haven't found much like jeans. Yeah. I usually find like shirts and cargo shorts. Cargo shorts. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we sell a ton of cargo shorts, okay? <laughs> All right, hopefully this gets better now. All right, hopefully we don't. What? Nothing. I was just looking. There's nothing. We're good. We're clear. I don't know, Kim. I don't know the answer to this. I was asking the same question today. She says, so now that Mercari, sh Mercari shipping has increased, do I need to go in and update all my listings? I have no idea. We sold a bundle of Mercari today. I have no freaking clue how that was priced or how. I don't know <laughs> luckily it was under a pound oh just stretch past patchwork are the keywords yeah if I find Patrick I get it and if I find um Madras plaid definitely I get it but I haven't found anything like that recently mm -hmm. oh you got lucky it was under a pound right because each listing was listed I looked at 15 ounces they bought three of them and they gave us a one pound label yeah uh, okay. okay. Hey, Adelaide. Matt says they will update it on their own. Girl. Come on, little girl. Whatever. We don't sell enough on my car for me to even like one tenth of the rest of them. <coughs> sorry, Christy. <laughs> Very sorry. I'm so, we're sorry. But it was our only sale today. <laughs> Besides the calculator. For $12. Somebody said it was World Head Covering or Hijab. World hijab day. Was yeah. it Hijab Day? Uh-huh. That's what and Post said. That's fantastic. So we sold three. Who knew? I guess some people knew. Not us. Adelaide, I'm here for you. In whatever way I can be. With men's clothes, color block, distressed, thrashed, patchwork, our biggest sellers for me. We haven't found anything like that lately. Yeah. Only cargo shorts. Polo shirts. Anything? Thirty. Waist. Thirty-four. Rise. Thirteen. Rise up. Rise up. All right, I'm gonna put that there so I can work my keyboard. Don't freak out. <laughs> 
I'm don't. not gonna freak out. I'm not gonna do what y'all think I'm gonna do. <laughs> so someone gave me a brand new attack to the Sony bathing suit new attack. Okay. I need you to look real close at it and make sure it's not for Target. Does that sound like the kind of item that would definitely that could they be for target? for target? I'm also gonna tell you something that you probably don't want to hear. So, um, I will wait to hear more. <laughs> oh, this one's better already. <clears throat> um, the style name on the Sony is. Okay, good. It's not a party thing. There are very few Missoni things with styles. So what you're going to have to do is Google lens it as best as you can. And if it doesn't, you're going to have to just describe the hell out of it. And describe it's like really good points. So if it's like a knit chevron pattern, that's really good. If it's a good color palette, like a 70s color palette or pastel color palette. Describe it that way. Miss Sony is not known for having style names. Like the dress we just sold for 600 didn't have a style name. There was no comp on it at all. So you have to sell it with your title. Like, sell it. Sell it. <laughs> <laughs> like, I mean, really think about it. Take like a good 10 minutes with that title. <clears throat> Miss Sony Mari. That's what it says, huh? Mm-hmm. I'll look it up for you. I don't know if I'll find anything. Miss Sony of the Sea. You can describe the waist on it. Is it high-legged, high French cut? Like, you know, you can see your hip bone. Is it bikini cut? Is it low plunge in the front like what is going on with this baby okay photos on the way Story Would 650 be too much weight? Yes. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> I'm sorry. So basically with Masoni, <clears throat> the things that are going to be worth the big bucks are the things that are like amazingly unique. Like the dress we had, in my opinion, because we have a bunch of Masoni in our, in our store and none of it is worth $600. The Masoni that we had, the color palette was absolutely stunning it was that like blush pink that's really on trend right now even though it was a y2k piece like some teal in there. there was yeah, yeah it was just a stunning color palette and then the drop waist of it and the the goring of the skirt it was just like a freaking it was probably a run panels are you kidding me the freaking panels it's probably a runway piece at some point let me check on their swim though i'm checking i'm checking to see what their swim goes for Swim is ready. This is why I say no. Let me just be like a little bit nicer and more considerate. Learns them. Give them an education. So about ready to wear. Your big name, I mean, your big dollar stuff is going to be your couture. The stuff that's like on runways, the stuff that's made specifically for a certain person or a type. And then you're going to have your ready to made to wear stuff that's at Macy's and Neiman's and stuff like that. And to me, swim is ready to wear items. You're putting them on a rack. You're making multiple sizes of it. And you're hoping to sell it to the masses, the upper middle class, rich masses, right? I just don't see Couture swim a bunch. And I'm looking for you. I've never looked it up, so I'm looking. I want to see the retail rate, and that's what's going to determine a lot in designer. It's going to determine a ton. Okay, so Missoni makes a line for Intermix, which is similar to like an H and M. It's it's an Intermix is like a story. It's a little bit higher in than H and M, but in Europe, and they're doing collabs. So 
You see what I mean? Do you see what I mean? Nordstrom's has a Miss Sony bathing suit. Am I trying to break your heart? I'm not breaking your heart. Please tell me I'm not breaking your heart. <laughs> <clears throat> it was like half the reason why I showed like the one I'm trying to eke out $100 for and then the $600 one. I was like trying to be like, not all Miss Sony's like this. Okay, so retail at the Nordstrom's, these bathing suits go for $600. Hundred for a one piece, three eighty for a two piece, and then like this one, Miss Sony Space Guy Stripe One Piece Swimsuit is on sale for three ninety six. So the rule of thumb in reselling that I don't follow ever, but the rule of thumb is fifty percent of retail for a new with tags. I'm yeah, it sure. is new with tags. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just, yeah, 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 for a new with tags. So you could start. I don't know what you have. I'm just. Spitball in here. I'm telling you the range of prices. These one pieces look like 660. One of these one pieces is 500. Couple hunch though. Yeah, I think you need to get a couple hunch for it. I think that the $600 price is probably going to be way too high, unless it's like a blogger favorite or something like that. Their two pieces are quite a bit less. It looks like like 430 full price. Tommy's over me. Just type in a brand on eBay search and it will pause it by popularity and what people actually search. <laughs> okay. Uh, I need pictures for the last thing you did because you're just in your own little world. I've been sitting here waiting. I'm sorry. Dance a stoner. Oh, he's not fighting back. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I mean, I. What am I gonna? I can't. Can't pretend that. I got nothing. Tommy, your your idea stands true, except when you have a one-off, well. which the the Sony dress we sold was a one-off. So looking what people were searching for and what they were selling for was no help. We let that thing list for like six months. I listed at 800 and then we got a $400 offer and we didn't take it. And then we got a $600 offer and we took it. Are you sure I didn't send you photos of the Escada pants, the gray ones? Mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure I did. I've got an empty list of you. That's all I know. Oh, you need to. Are these those? Yeah. Okay. Thank you. <sighs> now it smells like. <laughs> God. I'm glad our whole house is this morning is. But it just sucks that we have to work back here. Because normally we wouldn't be back here to be fine. You know? Yeah. These are not new tags, the Scatter fans, right? They are not new tags. Spot? Yes. All right, what's your list of now? These are Escada Sport. These are like brown stretch jeans. Any suggestions on how to get a smell out of a leather planker jacket? Mm. No. No motor mildew, but a musty storage smell. Freezer. Out in the sun, we don't have any sun right now. God, leather is so freaking. We put a freezer in the, I mean, a person in the freezer for a year, still didn't, didn't help. No. We had to get rid of it. There was just nothing we could do. It was just in there. Whatever it was. The Kate jeans. Huh? There's no model. No. Sure. Not a hundred percent, but let me see. Made in Italy, forty-two. Wash separately. Cameron, have you focused on packing though? 
Oh my god, you have such a pack. I'm so jealous. Are they straight leg? Let me see them legs. Yeah, they look straight leg. Right? Stinky. What? There's an extension called Keywords Anywhere. It tells you exactly how many times a word or phrase is searched per month. You'd be blown away by how little keywords are searched versus brands. Well, totally get that. 100%. I 100% agree with the brand. Like, if something's unbranded, I really don't miss it. And that's for sure. Got my 10 listing plan, just had to add photos. I found it was much better work with you guys than in the morning by myself. <laughs> yeah, no, I know you have to pack at night. We just didn't have anything to pack up. <laughs> we sold one thing today. One. Singular. No. One. Uh, what size? 42. We sold one freaking freaking thing. It was our worst day on eBay in years. One thing. <laughs> wow. Wait, forty two, you said. Forty two, yeah. That's an wrong thing. I can never know whether to put the U.S. size or the status size. Right. I've been going back and forth on my listing. <laughs> trying one here, one there. And once I kind of know, what's the rise? 12. Okay, can I talk? Can I just vent for a second? So there are four things for rise. Ultra low, low, mid, and then it says show all. So I have to click this. And there's only one more option, which is high. <laughs> Why doesn't the show all button just say hi? Right? Instead, I got to click it <laughs> and scroll down to high. It is like the, the most asinine thing in the world. And it just started doing it. the NC? <laughs> Isn't that crazy? It's so stupid. There's only one more option. Right. Waist size? 32 to 4. That's how you know that people using the software are not making the software. Because someone would be like, bruh. Yeah. Like, no. Yeah. What's the, is it a cotton channel? Yeah, it's like 96. Cotton, 4% real estate or something. Can you picture yourself for you? You all over there. <laughs> I don't know why I do this. <laughs> I don't either. This too, can there just not be an all season button? Can no? no? Okay, we're good. Fine. Yeah, pocket. That, that's dumb too. God. Okay, so the pocket type is now going into the seasonal type, which is fantastic. <laughs> when I click on seasons, it changes the pocket type. Yes, because those are related items. God. Uh, why, eBay? Why? I don't know, but I hope they get it fixed so my store works again. Seriously. Also, they don't put the price under the subtitle again, and all the eBay groups are like freaking out. They're like, why did eBay just charge me $4 for a listing? So people would just be subtitling like crazy, and they don't, don't, don't know. realize, yeah. Because it used to say, under, <coughs> and it's like a sliding scale now, so, oh. Like? They're probably working. It's a sliding scale, so <laughs> sometimes it's like eight dollars depending on <laughs> these people in these burgers. What's the number? Seven one eight four. Michael, honey. Oh no. No, no, no. no. <laughs> oh it does now it says two dollars. Yesterday it didn't. I That's want why... my two dollars. Now it says two dollars. What does that two dollars get you? Is the subtitle more than the promotion? We'll get you more. Right. Yeah. Is subtitle hack? Okay. 
pockets. All right. Love a pocket. So one yesterday, but it was like a hundred dollars, and my cost of goods was three, so it was good. Same day before, I sold one fifteen. Cost of goods four. Hopefully, something overnight. Yes. What's up, Brian? I only sold one item today too. Yesterday was my best Tuesday ever. eBay is possessed. Oh. Oh man, Cameron got seventeen orders. That's awesome. Nice. Are we listening? These are Donna Karen. Oh, this brand is so hit and miss. I'm going to sell the like, crap <clears throat> out of these. You just watch. Italian made, 100% merino wool, wide leg, brown pants. All right, we're going to call these merino wool. This is how you sell something, kids. Wide leg pants. They're knit. We're going to call them palazzo pants. They drag the floor. These are cool pants. So we're going to sell these on their features and not their brand. Get out of here, Tony. Get out of here. You watch me sell these pants. Whenever it's like a iffy brand, I like take that as a challenge. I'm like, oh, yeah? Well, these 70s-esque Palazzo pants are going to go real well on my title. And I'm going to sell them. Oh. Donna Karen's a great brand. Retail, my God. Very good brand. But resale, yee. <laughs> Not so much. Not so much. But, like I said, we're going to sell them. Because they're cool pants. They are cool pants. Would not have bought them. They were not cool pants. Love Merrimack though. Look, these only went for twenty five dollars. I love that brand so much. Okay. Merrimack though. Never heard of it. Yes, you have. We sold a shirt. Okay. Sold a shirt. <laughs> Never heard of it. Never heard of it. Man, so I put coffee in my chili and it looks like real smells like that now. Mm. Alright. Women size what? Large. There we go. That's a nice. What? My title. And don't worry. Don't worry. Number? 7185. Postcards. What are you talking about that? Oh, nine of the 17 were postcards, though. I woke up to two of my real photo postcards that sold for $50 each. Oh, that's awesome. That is amazing. How do you sell those? You just, like, title the heck out of them? That's amazing. I love it. Shut up, Matt. <laughs> Got to start a poll and take... Guesses on how many tabs Amy will have open by the end of the live. <laughs> Five dollars to guess, and winner takes half the pot. <laughs> Don't even leave me alone. <laughs> leave me alone. I'm working here. This is what's called working. <clears throat> Anything? 30. Waste. 28 to 36. Okay. So I'll just pick something in there. I'm picking something. <laughs>
occasion, formal, business, okay. party cocktail, casual, Birth birthday, birthday, <laughs> birthday, rise. Thirteen. Excuse me, while I click show all. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. You hate that kind of stuff. I, it's just like inefficient. It's clear that no one looked at that and we're like, wait, you have to click that anyway. Wait, what are we doing? Nobody cares. Tabs and dabs, young stuff. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Love it. Oh my god, young stuff. I'm just jealous because I do so much research. Y'all just jealous. In 995, jealous, aren't you? I'll put them at priority because I think it's... I'm doing good right now. I only have like five tabs. Yeah, you just wait. <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing great. Tabs and dabs. Y'all nuts. <clears throat> All right, we sold three things. That's pretty good. We sold three things. Oh, no, four things. One is a bundle. Tabs and dabs sounds like we are going to trip on LSD and get high as <laughs> <laughs> on the mash. These, these are 15 and a half. Take these out first. Okay. <clears throat> I'll change it. We need to up our first class price. I really don't want to, but we're losing money. Not a ton, but like enough to probably want to bump it up. <laughs> but then how many sales will we lose? Again, we're having a business meeting. Uh <laughs> I, would, I don't know if we would lose any sales. I really don't. Gary, what you got to do? And like I said, finally just told somebody three minutes ago, first sale of the day. Oh, same. We must be on the same server. They were like, oh, we'll, we'll turn you on for a hot minute. We got you, girl. You get five minutes. And I'm like, oh. <laughs> Tomorrow is supposed to get better in Dallas. It's like the one sheet of ice. You can't go anywhere right now. Dan went all the way to the post office and it was abandoned. There's not a soul there. <laughs> no note or anything. Just nobody. Like, Great. Glad I drove all the way over here. There was just nobody. And yesterday when he called, the lady was like incoherent. Okay. She must have been on drugs or something. Because he was like, are you and open? You know what? And when I got there, it was her. She was in the lobby, and she was like helping somebody with the kiosk. He was trying to mail like four certified with return receipt because the, they were closed. They left right. early. They, and I know that was the lady I talked to on the phone. I was about to call her out, but she scammed my scam form with a little handheld poo poo. See, I don't see the poo poo. <laughs> Man, this lady was so incoherent. She was like, hum, hum, hum. and Dan was like, uh, "Are you open?" She was like, hum, 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 hum. <laughs> Can I come in and mail my packages? <laughs> she was like a robot or like from the Jets. You couldn't understand a word. What was she even saying? I don't, I don't have any idea. She was like, I still hey, don't hey, know. Hey, 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 hey. Uh, what? <laughs> <laughs> and then he hung up and he was like, I mean, I guess someone's there. <laughs> he was like, I was talking to a okay. human, I think. Could what have was been. that? And then today there was just nobody at the post office. No, no one. <laughs> she was talking about, I mean, like, rambling like a crazy person. <laughs> you heard her. Yeah, she was like, and she was like, like she was carrying a conversation, but no words. <laughs> wow. 
Uh, are you open? <laughs> I was like, can I drive there? <laughs> so loud. <laughs> <laughs> Will somebody be there? <laughs> it was like we were living on the little house on the prairie or something. Right? I'm like, it should be a simple yes or no answer. <laughs> Are you open? There was there was nothing coming out of that. Yes. She was she was like confessing or something. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on there? I do not know. Uh-oh. You didn't even know what we would listen. New tags. Acris Punto. Look, I closed the tab, you a-holes. Oh, 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 oh. Ankle-length pant with square pocket. Yeah, that motto in Dallas, Texas, when it snows, does not exist. Dan said the same thing. He was like, what about rain, snow, yes. motto? Nah, they're like, nope, we out. Bye, suckers. <laughs> that lady is the ready post lady tied up in the back. <laughs> <laughs> no longer delivering a horse back. Well, this guy in our neighborhood is on skis today. <laughs> Skis with his little... I couldn't tell. I was like, I can't. I have to get a video of this guy. I can't. I can't do it. Why was he on skis? I'm telling you, I feel like he was our neighbor. I feel like he was you a think bro. think he was a neighbor. bro? I saw him getting skis out of his car. Right? Is this a black? <laughs> what? Yeah, these are black. Are they Technocrat and Franco pants? I don't think so. But... Ooh. Most of them have, like, a lady name. They didn't have a lady name, like a Cindy, a Frankie, a Mara. I'll keep checking. Let me see. $398 retail. In this boutique anyway. Right. I mean, this goes. Where are they, they are wool elastane with a viscose lining. You know, I think it's just the pocket side. So there's no, not really a lining. Right, is there you know a crease? Yeah, for yeah. my crease. No pockets on the back. Okay. Side zip. Eunice Agnes. <laughs> Agnes. <laughs> I said Agnes. <laughs> Agnes. Oh, Lord. Ooh. Oh, man. More tonight, y'all. I cannot. What size? 12. So I have a bad habit of pasting a title, like a search down here, and then like, copying it, and then I leave it, and then I pay two dollars. Five ankle length, front crease, square pocket, black. Bam. I have a theory on eBay sales. If you go one day listing something other than pants, I think your sales would jump significantly. <laughs> She's over us listing pants. Sorry. We got a lot of pants. So many pants. So many pants. They're relatively quick to list, but we're almost through the pants. We actually list other things during the day that are not pants, and they have been selling. Like calculators. <laughs> 
Sweatshirts. <laughs> she said, no, seriously, mine does that. It's so weird, though. Why would they give a crap if it's a sell-through rate issue? These, the sell-through on all of this is good. It's like, you know, I'm playing, I'm playing, I'm playing, I'm playing. I'm just like, mm. What's it? A wool, you said? Wool blend? Mm -hmm. Stretch. Just wool, a little bit of stretch. Twenty-six. Please. Thirty-six. Rise. Oh, Excuse me while I <laughs> scroll, scroll, scroll. Got it. <laughs> <laughs> so annoying. I jump from clothes to hard goods, and when I make a switch, I doubt my stuff seems to go the opposite way. That's crazy! Because then there are people that just sell shoes all dang day, every day, and they be doing fine. <clears throat> uh. <laughs> First, I guess. Some people in the chat are doing just fine, Cameron. <laughs> <laughs> no hate, though. No hate. Never. We want everyone to succeed, including us, kind of putting. Come on! Oh, Lord. Don't be swimming in money tomorrow. You just wait. Mm -hmm. My sale was a Lacoste shirt on Posh. Okay. You love me. You really love me. We do, <laughs> for sure. 17 sales is fine. Not jealous at all. Don't worry. Jealous of your art selling for fifty dollars. Pretty good, actually, though. Man, because that's like a replenishable too, right? You can just print some more. So good. Save that haterade. <laughs> oh man, camera kicking it back. <laughs> oh, the haterade. <laughs> haterade. I love it. <laughs> now nah, we love when people make sales. Seriously, mean that from the bottom of my heart. Love it. I think there's room enough for everybody in the reselling community, and all of us should be making tons of money. But me make money first, can't I? Great money, hey, good lord! Good lord, that's a lot of money. Lord. Good lord, there's a heavy party. Oh, that's gonna be priority. This one's for show. For show. The brand. Escada. Who got all these Escada pants here? Maybe these are the ones you just grabbed. <clears throat> Maybe. These have a style name. Come on now. T D. T E E D Y. <laughs> T D. <clears throat> Color navy. Now and open another tab and look it up. <laughs> TV. TV. I have to look it up in freaking eBay because everyone's rushing on me. Hey, don't let those people interrupt your workflow. Mm -hmm. Look, I'm reusing tabs now. I'm all self conscious. <laughs> <laughs> don't tell me about something, right? <laughs> That's right. My 12% wool, 98% stretch, grow with me, Corona high rise, black, workwear, wide leg, camel toe, green corn pants. Mm -hmm. Trousers have 50% sell through rate. One sell percent. Let's see. <laughs> nah, my pants have sell through rate. <laughs> hey, don't be changing. Don't be changing. Don't be changing. Telling you, we got down to like number nine in the women's pants category. We were having a good run there for a hot minute. Yeah, we were. God, it's good. 
I have a certificate in sell through right? <laughs> <laughs> I bet you do too. I bet you do. Do you have a certificate in TD Pants? Okay. <laughs> I took an online course. <laughs> I mailed me a certificate. Of course, when it does have a spell name, nothing comes up. And you're like, oh, fantastic. Wonderful. Why every do other I have time, this then? Right. Every other time, like, if only I had a style name. <laughs> There's no TDs. TD doesn't exist. That's what it says. I'm telling you what it says. I understand. But who's TD? <laughs> <clears throat> Check now. Hopefully, it's not like shoes went from seventy-five thousand sellers to one hundred and fifty thousand sellers in four months. Get out of here! <gasps> no, no, I checked the other day. I don't want to talk about it. We're not number nine anymore. Okay, maybe they started doing the report differently. Cause there's no way. That's crazy. Is there a button on the front of these? No. They just pull on down. No, they slide it. Oh yeah. Tommy went from number three to 23. Man, our, our women's pants went much down lower than that. It was bad. I think we're at like 129 or something right now. It's not good, okay? I don't really want to talk about it. And you're making me talk about it and I feel uncomfortable. <laughs> feel, feel confident in our new standing. We were in number nine. It's like a good place to be. Not no more. Why? Are they wool? They are 66 viscose, 30% polyamide, 4% elastic. That's what I was looking for. Okay, and I'm just going to ask the buddies, what size are they? 40. We didn't list a ton of pants Q4. It didn't seem like you. No, we didn't. We ran out of pants in Q4. <laughs> we listed a ton. <laughs> we ran out of pants. So we're, we've been on the hunt for pants. Finally found some. Finally well, we found some. Um, navy, ponty, knit, size of pants. Black, straight leg or slim? What, what, what's black? Oh, navy, sorry. Mm -hmm. Straight leg or slim. Um, I look pretty straight. Hold on. I am. I can never compete with number one and number two, so I treat number three as number one. Yeah, I know, totally. Did you just say hold on? Yeah, oh. Look how they're ponty. Thick. Very thick, but they're definitely sides. Um, the problem with the pants, Tommy, and why I'm like not letting you joke me about this, is we ran out of pants. We sold them all. Like, I think we had, what did we have? Like three pairs of Eileen Fisher pants when I did the thing? It's all in paper somewhere. We have like three pairs left. We sold like 50. And then, and then we, you know, and all the other brands too, the like Proving Connection, we sold every single pair of pants. The only ones we're not sold Those out of papers. are Eskandar because. Obviously. Yeah, we had five pairs of Lafayette. We sold them all. And. Yeah, we were left with three pairs of Eileen Fisher pants. And, and since I made this paper, we sold two of them. <coughs> so we like ran out of freaking pants. That's why our standing dropped. Dang it. What's the number? Yeah, I And so we tried to supplement with some J. Jill and soft surrounding pants, and this has been doing okay, but nothing like the uniform. The uniform does so great for us. And we got warm, so here we go. I like of the mindset, like, just 
rinse and repeat, keep doing what works. Because what works for one person can mean not work for another, and pants work for us, whatever. <laughs> Insane. We get less returns on pants, too. Yeah. Insane? 27. Waist? 34. And we're faster to list pants, so it's all good. We'll just list pants for the rest of our lives. <laughs> if only we had a source for like consistent pants. Yeah, they sell it rock bottom price with free shipping and free returns. I cannot. They must have a huge staff because if you're listing this of yourself, there's no way you can sell it like that. Your heart won't let you. Thirty thousand dollars a day. Can you imagine? Yeah, I just. I can't imagine. I'm like, can you imagine? <laughs> no, you can't. Who does that much? Like the sneakerhead. Oh, okay. Tech and um, sports says that. Same here. I think Q4 is going to be my weakest quarter from here on out. They are all putting out new models for Q1, so they stopped producing in Q3 to 4. Yeah. Shoes and fashions. What a great title. Number one. Sneaker cycle number two. I just need like a way to keep the inventory coming in. Like I wouldn't sell anything else. All this other BS we get at the bins and like shirts. I wouldn't sell any of it. I would just sell pants if I could. What's the rise on those? Twelve. Excuse me, I'll like click. Scroll, scroll, scroll. <laughs> <laughs> it's so like click all the seasons. Don't worry, I'm fine here. <laughs> If eBay would just watch a live list, they would see all the problems. Like, well, that's silly. I'm like, ah. Yeah, it is. Could you do something about that? Freaking scroll. But we don't want to get to the point where we need or have employees. Like, we're not at all interested in that. We're not interested in getting a warehouse. Although Dan would like to drive the little wheelie forklift. <laughs> he would love that. I would. We're just not interested in having any overhead at all. Like, I can see us one day, not soon, but one day moving into the garage because it's a bigger space. But we're not, we're nowhere even close to that. And we don't want to be. We're like, we want to make $9,000 a month from this little closet and be happy there. I just don't. You know, I was watching the Hustlin' Hooks in their Instagram. They're putting up more shelves. I'm like, what? So they have the same boxes we do. Wonder where they got that idea. But anyway, they have the same boxes. And then maybe they have like thousands of them. And they just keep putting up more shelves for more boxes. And I'm like, sell the stuff. <laughs> I would be so paranoid if we had 3,000 boxes of crap and we just kept adding I know, to I it. Just had, imagine all the money just sunk into inventory cost. I, I, and they have employees. I cannot imagine. I'm like, yes. y'all are selling, and they do have a lot of sales going out. I see their things, but not enough. If you're, if you keep multiplying at that speed, something ain't right, right? Yeah. Wouldn't you like stop and be like, wait, why do we have to put up more shelves? <laughs> we keep putting up more shelves. Oh, I'm not trying to be judgy. I don't know what it was like to run a big business, but to me, I would be questioning things if. Yeah, I mean. yeah. Yeah, sales are going up at the ASP. I know they don't share that, so that's I don't know about it. All I know is they keep putting up shelves. <laughs> <laughs> Just know what I see. And all I know is that we work in 220 square feet, and we always have, and we always will. And as soon as we outgrow 220 square feet, we either need an employee or we're not picking up good stuff, and that's an issue. And then we'd have to evaluate right yeah because dan went through we go through maybe like once every two months to condense he cleared out 17 boxes or 18 boxes so that's how much we were able to condense that's how much we had sold in the one or two months since you had done it last yeah 
And we had been like mini condensing in between there. Yep. So I think that's good. We're definitely not getting more shelves. There's no room for any more shelves. <laughs> and if we got more shelves, it would be like four shelves, you know, like, like one set of four. Maybe. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're maxed out on shelves. We are maxed out. No more shelves. No more inventory until we sell it. I have all listed inventory on two shelves. Oh, lucky. fantastic that's like a, such a great business model i dare you to instagram them that dare you <laughs> <laughs> Can you more shelves bro i mean send a picture of yours <laughs> right. uh, what are these these are eileen fisher i know i wouldn't be able to walk in here you have to get longer boxes <laughs> <laughs> you're right Right, just describe them. They got a bag. They got a, their side zip. They got a split hem. They are. They're twelve. Are they twelve? Organic cotton and spandex. Tommy's dying right now. I think they're twelve. Yeah. <laughs> He's dead. I just had like 20 terms in the search. <laughs> He's absolutely dead. This works better on the Goog. <laughs> and you should it. You should it. This is it. Look at look, we just spelled it out. And then look what they're actually called. This is the thing I want to draw your attention to, Thomas. <laughs> so oh, full I name. I write full name. I write Eileen Fisher side zip slit hem pants organic cotton spandex twill. The actual name of said pant Eileen Fisher organic stretch cotton twill slim ankle pants. Bam! <laughs> Bam! Tell me if I would have gotten that had I not searched that way. Come on now. And now I know exactly what it is. Get out of town. Mm -mm. Don't come at me. Get your own ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we got ice cream. Mm, okay. So it's on my mind. Are they new? No. Isn't that like khaki color or? Yeah, they're medium. Yeah, like straight, straight up khaki. Trying to find a spot coat. Was it made of Describe them perfectly. Right. Like what? Medium. And before you're watching YouTube, making lots of friends is what I feel are the best business models possible. James is the only person making money on the volume game. Rest of primitive struggle bus. I 100% agree. My biggest, nobody's asking, but I'll just say it. <laughs> What's the number? 7188. My biggest thing to get me to turn off YouTube videos is when people say, I bought this for $12.99. It sold for $22. I doubled my money. I click off immediately. I'm fine with that. I doubled my money. Buy. No. No, you didn't. Buy. Like, you're not actually running a business if you think that you bought something for 12. Well, 12 plus 12 is 24, first of all. And at 22, you definitely did double your money. But you're not accounting for fees or cost of goods. Buy. I have nothing to do with this channel. <laughs> I can't click off fast enough. And that's like every channel I watch is something like that. I mean, sometimes, you know, to get rid of things, we'll have a, you know, like a gimme. I get that. 
but when it's like consistent or when people are overpaying for goods and they'll do hauls and they're paying twelve ninety nine or fifteen dollars for like a Chico's, I'm just like I can't. I can't. It's just like such bad advice to run a business and other people are watching and make like quote unquote learning from it and makes me crazy. Wait guys. Thirty-two to thirty-four. So anyway, I don't want too much use of anymore. I try, but I just in the stations. And James makes it work because he has such a good work ethic and he has so much. Like the volume gain at ten thousand it's much different than forty thousand, in my opinion. <clears throat> yeah. You're way beyond. You're on a whole other level. Yeah, exactly. But 10,000 is like trudging. It's like so weighty. And, <laughs> but then if you have 30,000, it's less weighty because you're selling such a volume that you can kind of like manage. You know what I mean? Yeah, I think so. Ten into 30 plus shipping is doubling your money real estate. Exactly. But no YouTubers talk about it like that. I'm not going to name names right now, but a lot of the big ones that make like, that have like 20 to mm -hmm. 100,000 followers or more, they all be on there. And I like show it to Dan. I'll like write, he won't watch a YouTube video, but I'll replay like a minute of it. I'll be like, look at this. He's like, that's not doubling your money. That's stupid. I'm like, but they have 100,000 people watching them. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Falling down the rabbit hole. This first yeah. You want me to? We sounded unsure. <laughs> oh, unsure. Nope, unsure. I saw one of daily requirements guys making videos of being a six figure retailer. One of his guys, who's his guy? He said he made like 135K or something. I think he was down to 40K now with no health care. I'm pretty sure no guys is. Oof. Oof. Is that from cost of goods? Or is he promoting crazy? Like, what's happening there? Right. All right, we're in a skirt world. Do we do skirts? Whatever, right? Do skirts. Gotta do skirts. Everyone says they can't sell skirts. We sell skirts. Do you think we sell skirts? I think we sell skirts. We're about to find out. I think we, we sell skirts. We're about to sell this skirt. Sell this skirt. Nice. <laughs> you gonna wear it? Yeah. Can't love it. No, it just feels like it's not like the wool. Double knit. I get that one. Is that accurate? 100% wool. Wool and. This goes lining. This is not a double knit. You know, I know. Oh, oh look at that. A double knit would be this one. Okay, what? Sorry, ah. I'm sorry. Like, Acris Punto. Yes. This is size 12. I don't know if it has any other. Names or anything. Yep. Just wool with wool stretch. I guess the black has stretch in it and the white doesn't. <laughs> Since let's make fifty a day to make minimum wage. I had it I had to unsub. If you can't tell people the truth, I'm out. Say I, or if you don't know the truth. Right? If you can't tell people the truth, I'm out already for sure. Totally get it. But people don't know the damn difference between what's reality and like they don't know their business. Mm -mm. And you got a hundred thousand people listening to you. Goodbye. Wow. When he has 25 sales, shipping is 50% nearly because ASP is terrible. Wow, 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 wow. Angel said, honestly, I'm happy with sales over 25 as long as my cost of goods is so low, but not reliant on this as, you know, no, totally. I mean, 100% what you're saying, I get it. And we have both in our store because we do go to the bins once a week about. No. And we have some lower dollar things in our store that we're happy to calculator today they picked it up on the way out the door and it sold in one hour for 12 bucks like who cares 
So we do have that. It took Dan 60 seconds to listen. It's not a big deal, right? But we're not picking up tons of like clothes that are just going to sit in our house. In fact, the stuff that we do pick up that's worth 12 bucks, we know will flip immediately. Like, the sell-through is insane. Or we don't pick it up. And that's why when you watch our videos these days versus in the old days, we're like, the sold overnight, the sold overnight. We say it all the time because we don't waste our time listing stuff that's not going to sell. Potentially sell. Hopefully sell. Right? right? <coughs> hopefully based on data, not hopefully just, like, hopefully. <laughs> like... Like actually hoping <laughs> based on data of other things that have sold. These skirts, I'm more worried about it. Is anyone in skirt land? I was like, bruh. I feel like they did it with skirts. Maybe you had a feeling. Oh, no. No, no. I got a feeling. Thanks, Tommy. <laughs> Wait, what you're putting down? He said, sadly, YouTube doesn't reward reality. Every single channel that shows reality nowadays doesn't grow. <laughs> <laughs> Four years ago, that's all there was, reality, and they grew. Yeah, I grew up. I you. <clears throat> Thanks. <laughs> Woo! Oh, that stings. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Well, not on the top, but the big skirt. Not the two-foot skirt. But that's the oh, okay. Looking, looking, all right. Fluted. Full blend skirt. What's yes. that? 12. Size 12, yes. Knee length. Sure. I avoid those asking me to buy stuff or pay for it. <laughs> we appreciate you guys so much. What care? Aggressive something. I think certain YouTubers make this process sound glossy and wonderful, but fear to talk about real issues and challenges. And I question the point of content. Yeah, 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 yeah. What's Blacklist? Night, Amanda. Did we watch it? We haven't watched it. Oh, though. we haven't watched it. Who's it, Froggy? It was on NBC. It has James Spader in it. Sorry. It's like about a master criminal and an FBI agent. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we don't watch network shows. Ever. No, we, why do we do No, not ever. It's very rare. Rarely. Is it lined, that's right? Is it what, lined? Yes. There's a zipper? Side zipper, yep. No idea who y'all are talking about. <laughs> I know I'm a failure. <laughs> Kim, you are not a failure. <laughs> toys and plush are my passion, so I love when he finds amazing toys from my childhood. Oh, froggy flips. I, if this has flips or picker in the title, I don't watch it. I'm so sorry. I have an issue. I don't know why. I just don't watch it. Because I get them all confused and I'm like, yeah, okay. <laughs> I'm serious. Okay. 
from you though. He passed torn Terry Tornado. Oh my god, he used his real name. Wow, Tommy, we're making strides here. <laughs> For most smoking mirrors on YouTube. I haven't seen Harry Tornado do anything recently. He put out this thing today, actually. Let me just tell you. Uh -oh. He put out a floor plan of his, I guess he has a rental house or something. This is just on Instagram stories. Literally, I take one minute after I list things for an hour and I go through Instagram stories. So if I happen to upon it, I'll see it. And he put his floor plan and says, tell us how we should design the kitchen. And we'll give you a hundred bucks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I do that for like five thousand dollars. Excuse me. You wanna give me a hundred dollars to design your kitchen on your Instagram? When most people that do this charge five thousand dollars to design. Yeah, right? Yeah. Interior design is not a hundred dollars. No. <laughs> I thought that was so rude. Maybe it's because I'm in that industry, but I was like, hmm. Dang, that's kinda That'd be like if you had like a plastic surgeon. Friend, you'd be like, give me a no shower. Yo, man, hook up my <laughs> nose. I'll give you 20 bucks. <laughs> give me a tattoo. Ten dollars. I'm like, what? A hundred dollars to design a kitchen? Like, I went to I can't, I went to I have a degree. I have a certificate <laughs> <laughs> of completion. Why is your case short? Okay. Is that first class? Yeah. Yes, sir. All right, what are we working with now? I don't know. Let's see that knife blade thing. So. Schumacher. Schumacher. Yes. Yes. Yeah, he's using it YouTube money and investing it. All right. Sh Schumacher. S C H U M A C H E R. Yes, we got it right because it's a German thing. Yeah, you do. You spritz the Deutsch. Retail four seventy eight. Okay, this is a knife plate. Yeah. It looks a little bit. You know what it reminds me of? Um. Okay. Helmet long. Yeah. Cause all asymmetric and. Yeah, this looks like a. This looks like an anime chip skirt kind of. <laughs> Hi Megan. Going to lurk long day. Oh, I'm sorry. Lurk. Love the lurking. You know he hasn't looked at maybe he has an account people don't know about. I love old toys too. I love the um Man, I don't know. I just keep doing what I, if I had that many followers, knowing how much you can make on YouTube with that many followers, I would just keep on keeping on. Yeah, right. I'd be like, mm-hmm. Nice. That's why I don't fault him. I'm like, girl, he bought himself a new nice house and a car. Like, he's always trying to tell people about Dave Ramsey though. I feel that a little bit sus. But I was like, Oh, you Dave Ramsey and my money from your YouTube? Okay. I guess there's worse things you could do. I don't know what we're going to do about this skirt. I've never listened to this brand. Schumacher. Schumacher. Uh, back of the throat. Wait, is he short? <laughs> I thought I was the only short person. Who's short? Okay, enough picking a short people. I have 85 pairs of shoes to pack headed to the bayou. To the bayou? Who are you sending shoes to? You go to Louisiana. I 
this one's on the railroad. Dorothy Schumacher. Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Learning. It's just, it's just nice. You can just tell. It's like heavy. You know what I mean? He needs a step stool to get in a party. Stop. Stop. <laughs> you can't make fun of short people on here. Oh, no, offer. You can't make fun of short people on this channel as a rule. We have two rules now. <laughs> <laughs> Schmacker skirts. Okay, we got extra buttons and all sorts of stuff going on down here. I'm like the shortest person on YouTube, so get up. Come keep, at me. Keep me, it says. What? Keep, keep me. me. Yeah, these skirts are selling. 100% they... wool. Yeah. Yes. He's German, yeah. Linda stuff. She's so good. Every listing I copy is Linda. She is so good. Linda's stuff is so good. Linda's in Pennsylvania. I have to go to Pennsylvania. Maybe go meet Linda. Oh, I didn't know. I want to go to Wolfie's. Hmm. I'm going to message him. I don't definitely want to go to Wolfie's. To see him. The weekend, maybe. Good friend in Louisiana, but it's full whenever way too much. Keep the cash flow. That's good. Yeah, no, but that's good that you're having the wherewithal to like clear it. Some people would hoard that ish. You know, they get that greedy vibe going on, like I'm gonna list it all. You never do. What size? Um, the this tag from the boutique, the price tag says large, but I don't see that like an indication of the size. Being like, oh, that's fancy. I didn't know it had that. A little nice panel there. Oh yeah, large. Does it say anything else? Does it say article, effortless, chic, anything like that? No. It says Schumacher, made in Poland. Shell, 100% wool. Uh, cotton elastane trim fabric. Got the extra buttons. Care yeah, instructions. He just calls it a button skirt. Oh. I got shoes with your dresser here. We didn't have any, yeah, right? I'll just go by remotes, become a rock. There you go. Jim comes in. Ha ha. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, y'all need to stop it. Love all y'all equally. Number? 7190. How are your pictures of this sucker? Because I might print it up. Pretty good, I think. Okay. But we'll see what you think. I love selling at Alan Edmonds. I love it. Get her uniform stuff. I, I don't know, but sometimes, like, she does, they do auctions and really? score stuff pretty cheap. You 
buy stuff from Linda? No, but I've watched something before. One thing of Linda? Yeah, it was like a dress shirt or something. I'm so jealous. What if Linda's lurking? Hey, Linda. <laughs> Lurky Linda. I pay up for shoes, but they are hand picked, bag, ready to go. Just pull up, throw them in the car, and roll. I spent hours sourcing now, one to three hours driving. So see, that's, that's the dream. Yep. First class. Hello, hello. We do the same thing, but it's not regular. <laughs> that's the issue that we have. We need a regular source. Like, we'll hit something like that once a month. And then, like, way too, like, right now, we have bags and bags and bags of stuff to list until the next one and then another month, you know? I wish it was something like 50 things or 100 things a week. But instead, we'll get like 500 things. <laughs> God. <laughs> I just read back in the chat. I love when Tommy goes off. <laughs> yeah, missed it. Everybody already wants to know the leg opening. Always the leg opening. We gotta start measuring the leg opening. No. Can't keep answering these questions. Won't do it. This is a posh question, so we might buy it. And then you gave the lady the, the shoes and she didn't even. Right. Wait, wait I can see what else. No, 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 no. Did you send the pictures? I almost put the wrong pictures in this listing. Bruh. <laughs> Did you send them? Okay, I must not have hit. Uh, I was on this screen. <laughs> Awkward. Top views anymore. Down like 30% month over month. So to save space, he's going after Graham Steven, I get. Stefan or Steven? Yes, I noticed I've been trying a bunch of different things. Hoping you want to pop. I have not noticed at all. So interested though. What's these? Spot. Spot. There's a spot right here. You're trying to baby linen. No. Silk linen. I ain't washed them in skirt. I'm just gonna make sure it's worse and do the next one. You better you gotta comp that before I wash it. It's got beads and everything. Oh god. Oh god. No, don't want to. Go a little higher in this one. Try. We're going to see what happens, kids. We're just going to see what happens. Yes, we are. Doctor guys, who's a doctor? <clears throat> Drink the Kool Aid.
Oh, you got something against broke people? What is this? Lafayette 148. 100% wool and the plates here. Wool and what? Nothing. 100%. What is this animal print? Animal print skirt? I don't know. I can't tell if it's trying to be like a leopard kind of thing or like a python. I'm not really sure. <laughs> Man bear pig. Oh my god. I knew it. <laughs> Why did I know that was coming? <laughs> Is it new? Nope. All right. I've got you in these skirts. I'm about to pull you away. Like, sir, step away. You better have a banger in here somewhere. Come on. You best. I'm swinging at you. Homeboy got all the good stuff while he was in the skirts. Actually, I don't think he got one back all his stuff. Oh. She was oh. like, no. <laughs> no. Yeah, the one where I was like, how does he think he made almost 100 in profit? He never suggested that he made fees. Eesh. And cost of goods. Shipping. I don't know. Somebody. Somebody. I have I, ninety percent time. They're talking about people. I've been, okay. <laughs> not even one little bit of a clue who they talk about. One time he was talking about saving like twenty dollars a week, but it was going to cost him multiple hours per day. That's when you know it's bad if twenty dollars is worth three to four hours a day of work. Yikes. What size is this? Timeless. We're gonna go with timeless. There you go. How you sell things? Then with Lafayette one forty eight was fun. Lafayette. Come on, eBay, you can do this. <laughs> if I split it right, it would help. Seriously? Lafayette 148? What? Am I in the right category? We've been selling it. I know. <laughs> Here we go. Finally caught up. Caught up with us. You can't understand the need of a food drop bank for emergencies when you can't list. That's just money sitting there. He's been complaining about a bunch of in ads lately. He a lot of damage bin stuff. What are we talking about? <laughs> so, here's the thing about the bins, in my opinion. I'm just going to join the conversation, even though I don't know who you're talking yeah! about. Yeah! Junk in, in equals junk out for sure. But not everything at the bins is junk. So, we spend more time at the bins, but we come out with less junk. We used to come out with tons of junk, but now we're much better. Dan's coming out with Dolce and Gabbana. He's coming out with everything. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, I got two two Dolce pieces and a uh, mosquito. Yeah. So not everything is terrible, but what's the number? Seven one nine one. I can see how you could get wrapped up if you went to the bins every day. Sometimes you go to the bins, we don't get much, and we're like, oh, better get something. We've been here all day. I know that feeling. I do know that feeling. Doesn't mean I act on that feeling. We will stay there till we find something. We also don't go to the bins during business time, though. We go as fun. You know, that's terrible. But 
We work at home. We do not leave the house. We work you know, at home, and then like on Sunday or something, we'll hit up the bin. So if we stay there all day, it doesn't matter because it's not during. We're not losing business hours on it. We right. wouldn't be working at home anyway. But I can see going to the bins every day and actually getting junk. I can see it. You can get you can get on that train real quick. Mm-hmm. If you're trying to play the golf volume game for sure. Right, just try just go in there and scoop every pair of jeans you could. Yeah, exactly. Or every cargo shorts, <clears throat> yeah. or every whatever. Yeah. So basically our business model right now is having April list that stuff. So we give it to April. We go to the bins and try to find her about fifty things, which meets our pound threshold there. Spend about fifty bucks. We give her fifty things. And we pay her hundred and fifty bucks. So list the fifty things. So that's like two hundred bucks in, all in. And she's made us hella money so far. I have a tag for her on Gundu, and she's made us over $2,500 profit since she started working with us. And there's still a bunch of things left to sell. It's great. And then we list all the estate sales stuff. So we don't have we don't really go out sourcing just on Sundays for fun, for April. And if we don't get anything at the bins, like we only went to the bins once this month, we'll just give her stuff out of here, you know, stuff that we have from the estate sale that's not black still an issue but it's it's good to have that little bit of help for things that are yeah not as important you know like chico's pants who cares right who cares i wouldn't buy chico's pants if they weren't new and tight so that's not what i mean I'm not getting those of the bins but all the stuff she's listing from the bins is selling mm-hmm. we had one issue with the stain that she didn't catch and i didn't catch so that sucked but other than that, it's been fun. We're still playing it by ear, though. You know, slow and steady. We didn't, like, hire a full-time employee with healthcare and yeah, exactly. the whole thing. We're like, let's try this out and see how it works. Uh, you sent me two backs, I think. I believe. I'm trying to open it, but it's going all slow. Both of like the same picture of the back, huh? No. The one, this one, this is the back. And you, you can see less of it on the That's just the sticking out. It's from under. Oh, that's in there. Yeah. Box blue, I mean. No, but he's very limited in knowledge. He buys Walmart brands and antiquated. Oh, no. We don't know, man. Uh, Angela, we can't figure it out. I don't know, it could just be me, but his and a lot of others in the group's whole business model just seems race to the bottom. April has been kicking butt, that's awesome. April has been kicking butt, and it's so great for her because she loves it because she can do it in her spare time. And she gets money. We're paying her very fairly. like So that feeds my philanthropic side as well because she's an artist. I love supporting artists so that they can art. It's like win-win all the way around. And she, like, delivers that stuff, and she's never, you know, if I deliver somebody something, I'd be like, oh, my God, that was a lot this week. She's never like that. She's like, oh, my God, here you go. <laughs> you got any more for me? We're like, uh, yeah. <laughs> all you can handle, bro. The problem is Tekken Sports and Daily Refinement Method is quantity over quality. When you're trying to build a customer base, those words don't even mix. The amount of returns is due to crap fixtures and listings. Yeah, when you're like, they do a listing in one minute. Photos and everything, right? Isn't it something like that? Those That's ladies, nuts. Those ladies taking photos, they're like, flip it over, tag, 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 send. It's crazy. Hopefully they don't have iPhone 14. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching. It's crazy today. Our sales are so low. 
it's good to have days like those every once in a while, though, because then when people complain about it, you can kind of like commiserate with them. You know what I mean? Yeah. It, it really helps because you're like, oh my god, I know. Oh man, if you haven't had a slow day in a while, it's weighty. <laughs> I didn't realize we hadn't had a slow day like that. You know, you don't realize it until it happens, and you're like, "Holy crap!" We made when I showed the venue today it was thirty seven dollars oh, profit. That, that reaction, my reaction on the video was one hundred percent real. <laughs> thirty seven dollars profit. That's not happened Dang. to us since like twenty twenty. <laughs> oh man, it's rough. It's okay. Hey Melissa, how you doing? All right, I just listed this. All right, let's listen to the next one. This is a Lafayette 148. New with tags. Black Miss Ghost Blend skirt. You want to try this number? Yeah. MSG 25V dash J003. Yeah, the sales, you know, it comes in those. It'll be fine. Is there a pleat front skirt? There is no, no nothing in the front, and the, and the rear has two. Oh, dual. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Hey, Lynn. Lurking and learning. I swear that's a Python print skirt. All right, if you think it's Python, I'll put it. I don't know what it is. I'll go back and put Python. Python. I think it's Python, too. You think it's Python? Yeah. I'll definitely put it. I just put animal print. I don't know. But Python sounds sexy, huh? Yep. I feel like people want that. Who wants a Python print? Want anaconda? Don't want not I mean basically right? Exactly. Is it anaconda? Okay. Ah. Uh, no, it's a different animal. Okay, I don't know Jack. <laughs> I don't want to know. Then you're talking about. Bleh. All right, let's see here. View listing. I'm gonna I'm gonna do this for you right now. Revise listing. Look in Python. Sometimes you need the um. You know, the pull the crowd. Image. Melissa looked up the cruise. Sounds amazing. So much fun. So much fun. So much fun. Love it. I, I would prefer if it was on land, but go love it. Are we gonna offer yes, yeah, I'm taking this off right. This Zara jacket is too cool. People also say you can't sell, sell Zara and I just Zara sells. It really does. I mean, I know that the Salvation Armies were just flooded with it, and we were not part of that, and we haven't listed Zara Sims, so I don't know. Things might be different now nowadays. But the Zara we've been listing has been selling. I ain't mad about it. Yeah. Is there any stretch in that skirt? A little bit, yeah. It's on Norwegian. And. I think we're on the pearl again. Norwegian pearl. Yep. Washy really washy good. happy happy. <laughs> <laughs> it's good because we have the artist pass, so we have like kind of like a special dining room so I can ask for all my dietary things. So I, got a, I got us a meeting with Chef. <laughs> I squared away. Chef meeting. I do. What was the size on that? <laughs> um, 12. Number? 7192. Pictures are on the way. It's 
not much about the boat. It's just like all the music. It's like all these bands and it's always something to do. There's not much cruising happening. I mean, you're on a boat in the water, so but, but you know what I mean. It's like it's a music festival at sea. Yeah, it's all about the concerts. I don't even realize that we're on a boat half the time. Yeah. No, we're having issues all the way around. These are all first class, right? I've been asking. Yeah. 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 All right, what we got going on here? Oh, I mean finally Fisher. a tag. Yeah, new tag. I mean Fisher, what? Organic cotton stretch jersey black pencil skirt. That's what the tag says. Know, but... That's what the tag says. What's the retail? Oh, God. $108. Oh, my God. Look for a red jersey and skirt. That's Linda, she's up in here again. Man, Linda, stop. How you get that logo? Wait, y'all, real talk. How Linda get this logo? What logo? Well, Linda's stuff logo. Oh. I don't know how you get it. And see, Linda has all niche down stuff, and so she could do one of those 50% off of four with the coupon. That's a really good coupon because then mm -hmm. you're encouraging people to get four. Yeah. So on this one where it says, so this is our like, Idol Linda stuff. We love Linda. Don't know Linda, but we love her. How do you get that logo? It's it catches my eye, so it must catch other people's eyes. For sure. Everyone's silent. Nobody knows. I don't know. I'm gonna have to Reddit this since none of y'all know. Nobody else has a logo except Linda. She's got like the lock on the logo. <laughs> the biggest store you get a logo? Really? And that's the biggest store probably. Linda's big. It's a big store. Linda has employees. I'm gonna go stalk her. Don't worry. What's the size? Mm -hmm. This is what I want to say. No, where's my search? Lord. Oh Lord. <laughs> it's Jersey, right? Jersey. Mm -hmm. Brand new. Just use the last of the milk and the roads are supposed to be worse tomorrow. This is the beginning of the <laughs> <laughs> nah, the roads are going to get good tomorrow. It's going up. 
going up the um I heard the roads are gonna be okay after the morning. Once the sun comes up, you can go get milk. Ice storm warning until nine AM Thursday. Hey, yikes. Yeah, but it's kind of fun. You know, in Dallas, we're at like thirty two this whole time. So I don't think our ice storm's actually gonna ice storm us. And then by um, 10 a.m. we're at 34, 11 a.m. 35. He's good. How do you get? How do you get a? Lo I have a logo, but not on the listings page. I have one on my like store page. How do you get it? Like where Linda's is. I would. I just want to be like Linda. What's your number? Seven one nine three. Alright, if y'all don't tell me, I'm just gonna look it up on Reddit. So maybe... I'll call Linda, don't think I won't message her because of what You won't call her, you make me call her. I'll be like, Dan, I need you to call Linda. <laughs> She's gonna be like Linda, listen. Hey, Linda, it's Dan. Oh <laughs> 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 is this Linda? <laughs> She's probably got all these boys, excuse me, Linda. Every female that answers. Oh, you don't work out of your closet? Hmm. My name's not Linda. Linda. Kim's like, listen, Linda. <laughs> Linda, we're inquiring about your stuff. Get the door next to feedback on Seller Hub. Oh, Lord, I gotta go through the thing. Hold on. Well, hang on now. I think have to pop this up a little bit. I'm trying to be greedy. Okay, now I'm gonna show you Linda. Hold on. So when I go here, look at this. Oh, where's the Linda? <laughs> what the heck? Picture's coming. What? Where, did you lose it? I lost Linda. Oh man. It'll say it like right there, underneath top rated plus. It's, right it's like here. Linda's stuff. Literally, it says Linda stuff. And it's like in a font. Hold on, let me add you to the thing. And I lost Linda. <laughs> to me, I think if I had a logo there, it wouldn't say the hustle couple of was awkward, but. Some kind of logo. I don't know. I think that would be really eye catching. Because I notice Linda every single time. Yep. I'm like, well, there's Linda. <clears throat> Linda, right here. Look, like right here. Linda stuff. See? Can you guys see it? Yeah, my computer's up. She's got a hell of a sale going on, too. I might go central into the store for some deals. Oh, this could be good. Right? Washable stretch crepe skirt. Oh. Knee length pencil skirt. $158 retail. Maybe. System. Just want to be Linda, y'all. Like, That's the cup, cup, coupling. What? Coupon. Coupon. Your coupon has a logo. I have a logo for my coupon, but it doesn't show up in search. I think you're wrong. I have never seen anyone's logo except Linda's. I never seen my own logo. That's a top rated. Let's see if anybody else. See, they have a coupon, no logo. I think Linda might have like an anchor store or something. That would make sense. I mean, you gotta get Linda's, something. Linda sold a bunch of stuff. 
Like, <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Listen, Linda, it's cracking. My name's not Linda. You listen here, Linda. <laughs> I would take the rest of my time and go home. No, it's not the name of the coupon. For sure, it's not the name of the coupon. Because all these other people got coupons. Look, Linda, <laughs> blew it up. Nice. Linda, stop. <laughs> Zoomed in on it. I think Linda got an anchor store. I'll make down an email. Don't worry. Come on, Zara already paid. Let's go. Let's do this. Found all your missing G's, yes. All right, can you uh, tell me exactly what this is again? Knee length pencil skirt. What did it go? Washable stretch crate. Meet medium? Yeah. Yeah, I have a photo on my coupon too, and I ain't showing the search. I ain't Linda. She sells in our category, so I see her almost every time I look up a comp. There's Linda. <laughs> like, son of a... Yeah. She's been, she been around for a while. She's been selling a while. She's got a good hookup. I don't know where or how. She just been signing, too. Look, this brand new one sold for $99.95. Would make this one sell and the other one's not sell for this much. You know I'm going for it, though. Oh, yeah. I know you're going for it. Jake the, Jake's Boutique, who I'm copying right now, he ain't got a logo. Seven one nine four. Ah, what? I just figured what the CL stand, stood for on the other spot. Catholic. This one's KL. Like. That wasn't anything. I never said the other one was a Well, it said pencil skirt. It's like a pencil skirt. Or it's CL pencil skirt. Catholic. Catholic. Mm. Ho! Ho! Oh. Ho! Oh. 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 What happened? Oh. Whoa. Oh, 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 oh. What's going on? What's going on? Who What's going on? Talk about pants. Oh. Counter offer. Okay. Okay. Please pay. Please pay. <laughs> I just sold a pair of pants for two hundred and ninety-five dollars. Yes. Got to make up for a thirty-seven dollar day. For real. <laughs> Meant that she's your sneaker thought sneaker cycle. I get it. Yep. Linda is sneaker cycle. <laughs> Like people change the HTML when showing 98 No, they do not. What? How do you do that? It's probably just change the HTML. You can't change your 98 Will really? So, okay, let me just say this to anybody who's listening and has any, I like any earthly want. I know we got lurkers. That's why I say this. I used to think the same thing. Melissa just said, who has $300 to spend on pants? I used to think the same thing because I grew up poor as dirt and I wouldn't list my clothes high enough. Now I've changed my mindset permanently to people shopping on eBay because they want to keep up with the Joneses. $300 is way better than $3,000. Mm -hmm. So it's a bargain for them. 
for people trying to keep up with the Joneses, because real designer like rich people ain't on eBay, okay? It's people trying to keep up with those people. So 300, so you look at the retail value and you look at what everybody else is selling them for and you price yep. right where they can afford it. You know what I mean? They live in a nice luxury lifestyle, eating sushi one or two nights a week with some sake. Yep. They got the, the house with the three stories, the basement, the 25 kids, two golden doodles. Right. And they need their Audi. Alcorn purple label alpaca pants. They need alpaca pants. <laughs> the girlfriend got alpaca pants and she ain't got, I don't have alpaca pants. Right. But the husband's like, I can't spend $3,000. Well, I guess I can get them. Oh, 300 hey, oh. <laughs> You got to create these stories in your head because if you're only living your existence, you're going to underprice your goods. Because you can't imagine someone spending three hundred dollars on a pair of pants. I can't. Right. But, but just just for for scale, or whatever for comparison, when I was looking up Laura Piana stuff on their website, when I was researching that bomber jacket, mm -hmm. quote unquote bomber jacket, they have a new one with like made out of the world's rarest alpaca or something, Acuna, I believe is what it's called, but it's a freaking a hoodie. And it's like thirteen thousand dollars <laughs> for a hoodie. So if you got that, oh, I need photos. If you got that as a thrift, you post them. it for like a thousand, no problem. Because a thousand better than thirteen thousand. Yeah. Right. Thirteen. Th I'm, like I couldn't even. I'm gonna look it up right now. <laughs> Laura Piana. I think it's the jacket, the Acuna bomber you know, jacket. It was a hoodie. <laughs> Uh, no, Vic Vicuña. No, that's what that's what it's called. Acuna Matata. Yes. <laughs> what a wonderful phrase. Yeah, it's some sort of what the Vicuña. Um, I think it's an alpaca or a llama. I don't know. Classic bomber made out of Vicuña. How much you is? I know Tommy's obsessed like I am right now about Linda. Okay, hold on. Let me get you, Linda. Classic Bomber, $9,125. Oh, that's so true. $300 for pants are <laughs> associates who aren't partners yet, but need to look like they are. Yes. Partner there you material. Go. There you go. <laughs> Wait, can't you just look up Linda's stuff? Linda's you can search for the, yeah. On eBay right here, just type it in the search. She comes up in the search. Wow. Linda's banging, y'all. Linda comes, her logo comes up in search. Wow. Who else does that? Anybody? Oh no, y'all. She's the grill. <laughs> <laughs> I'll pack a ball. I'll pack a ball. I'm there. Uh, holy. I was gonna look up the HTML. See how you can't HTML search. Man, Linda came up in search. Dang. Linda, that just happened. The goat. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I used to work with people who make millions a year. It was so eye-opening. Like they would make my annually annual salary in less than a month. It's it's crazy and sickening. So we go to these estate sales and these really mansion rich parts of Dallas. Not sickening, whatever, you know. Anyway, yeah. And the amount of clothes that these women have <laughs> is one thing. But the amount with new with tags, it's astounding. They will have eighty pairs of black pants new with tags. Eighty pairs. Yeah. Just like never even looked at them. That's what I'm saying, Tommy. Like, yeah, three point eight million items sold. Linda's been moving stuff. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what be Linda? Y'all, can we get Linda on a guest guest spot? Oh, right. <laughs> wait, can we get Linda? Can we get more YouTube followers? <laughs> we got the Linda. Oh my God, guys! This week, <laughs> she's a mini target. That's funny. <laughs> Irony, they buy all the clothes and then they're dead and the clothes are being sold for pennies on their Yes. But that's what I'm saying. They don't these clothes have no value to them. They don't make them feel better. They're not trying to prove anything. They just get them. Right. Like like if you it's like you and me going to Target to buy a pair of 
of jeans or whatever they go to neat to bergdorf's and buy 300 or thousand dollar pants like that it's crazy my lo- my yeah. <laughs> I don't have logos. Right? Either. <laughs> Can you call your concierge and ask how you get a logo in search like Linda? <laughs> sorry. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, I keep saying Linda. I'm obsessed with her. <laughs> All right, I do have quite a few tabs open. <laughs> Is it, who said 12? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Who had 16? Eee, who had I was, 16? I was being conservative because I knew y'all were watching. <laughs> Probably would have had like 27. True. Oh, Tommy's going to call. Yeah, yeah. Calling now. <laughs> oh, we're staying on. We're staying on. Going to know. <laughs> How do you get that? You sell... 3.8 million items. That's how you get that. <laughs> I swear, it probably comes with an anchor store. Because if you're selling that much volume, you got to have an anchor store. Yeah, you got to. I wonder how many anchor stores there are. I have all the questions. Just keep asking Tommy. He's on the phone. With me. <laughs> how much is the anchor store? It's a lot. It is a lot. What? It's like hundreds of dollars a month, right? Well, I'll just Google it. Calling these people in the middle of the day and night. Three fifty a month. Yeah, three fifty. But well, you could have an enterprise for three thousand a year. Maybe you have to have an enterprise. I'm about to pay three thousand dollars for a logo. I'm not even kidding. <laughs> that logo was so clutch. <laughs> a good investment three thousand dollars for the year not bad. i mean what does that break down to <laughs> 250 bucks a month well that's cheaper than anchor yeah that's weird ringing <laughs> <laughs> does bhfo have a, a logo jen 10.4 million sold. Wow. What did you say was B? BHFO. Nope, no logo. Dang. I'm just got to give me three minutes to verify and get answer. <laughs> where, where are we? You got your three minutes. One does. Now it's not coming. Oh, it's because I'm not in not the dang the dang dang store. Okay, let me try B. B-H-F-O. B-H-F-O. What's up? Oh, yeah. You just got to wait a second. Dang, Linda. <laughs> <laughs> Are you what kind of boy you get with it? You might... You know, you tell me called it faster than James after an hour without saying... <laughs> I knew Tommy was going to be interested. <laughs> oh, you get that. He's like me. He's like, he wants all the bells and whistles. Yeah. Always been jealous of her. I just figured it was like an anchor store thing. We're waiting. Wait, right? We're waiting. Let's see if they pay for these pants. What do we think? What are the odds? Oh, uh, come on. I hope they do. Oh, one of these is a beer sale. So sweet. Oh, nice. I love when people leave a note. And I know. That was very sweet. Did you cancel the plush mark? Is that something? No. I'll do that. Sorry. Morning, Dallas. I'm commenting on that right now. Okay. <laughs> Let's say going on a Sunday first. 
Lindsay, was that right? Yeah. What's going on, Sal? Tommy's calling eBay hey, right now. Right? We're in a holding pattern. See, Sal, look, we're trying to get this. See how Linda's stuff has like a, you know, like this on search. It has a logo. And then if you go to her stuff, so Linda's stuff <clears> up here. <throat> Hold on, I got to turn your computer on. Oh, dang, I'm trying to show. There you go, computer zone. Linda's stuff. So she gets this logo. She is looking up Linda's stuff. <laughs> <laughs> I'm dead. She has to the apostrophe. Don't forget the apostrophe. Tommy's on the phone with eBay right now. <laughs> getting, to figure this you're out. getting breaking news right here on the Hustle Couple channel. <laughs> and then we're going to go interview Linda. She's the leader in luxury consignment, okay? Oh, maybe that's why. She like definitely highlighted it. She consigns. That's where she gets this inventory. Yeah, yep. Right? Yeah, it is. The screen is definitely on. So we're trying to stalk her, basically. Dang, Linda, two thousand dollars. Linda don't play. Linda got these mannequins and everything. <laughs> How many <laughs> listings Linda got? <laughs> Sorry, I keep saying. Linda. <laughs> Wait, you know Linda? Wait, is it an actual store? I guess I can go to this website. Aren't you not allowed to link That's what he says. Own... Yeah, he used to work in the same complex. Well, how does she get her logo all over eBay? Shop Linda stuff. Even ThreadUp doesn't have their logo all over eBay. Shop. Where do you live? W Warminster, PA. God, we're going there. <laughs> I'm going to find Linda. Look, she doesn't have good Google reviews. Uh-oh. Uh weird to me that she could put her website on her eBay. Does she do live sales on here? Shop or does it link to eBay? Is this a I was going to say spot of Shopify? Could be, yeah. She just linked to it right from her eBay. <gasps> Wait, you can't do that. Why not? <laughs> because you're not allowed to sell a platform, right? Flippin' Sports Guy says, I've known so many people that work there, they all said horrible experience. Oh, I can't believe you know Linda. We're just trying to figure out how to get her logo. We don't care about her. She's got, like, Uber standing. Let's see about ThreadUp, because ThreadUp's really big on eBay, too. Most people don't know that ThreadUp's on eBay. But look, ThreadUp and eBay stores, they don't have a logo. Yeah, that's crazy. And thread up, look at this. They have more. Look. They have what, million listings or something stupid? They're not, not quite that much. Right? I guess they're not as big as Linda. They have, <laughs> they have 3 million 791 items. Strict listing requirements. You miss your quota twice and you're gone. Dang. Damn, Linda. I told you, she don't play. <laughs> Krillin said she must be sleeping her way to the top. <laughs> you don't know her. <laughs> you leave her alone. <laughs> I can't believe someone knows Linda. Oh, man. Wait, is there an actual Linda at the top of all of this? What about Lux Swap? Krillin's asking. No, I'm in. Hold on. I'm in. I'm in. Oh, you're good. Eday, eBay search. There you go. Is there a space? No. One word. Is it? Yeah. No, it's the, yeah. Oh. Okay. I've seen some auto part sellers with one also. Adidas and Best Buy's official eBay stores have logos also in search. So I don't know what the hell the parameters are. You guys are <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Megan. Have a good night. Good night. <laughs> We are crazy. Um, Luxop is like small potatoes. They only have 530 items. He owes me like 500. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Did you swap Luxes? I 
I bet you it's Enterprise Store. For three thousand dollars, it's cheaper than the um. The anchor. Yeah. That's weird. But you have to pay it up up front for the year. Yeah, but so what? Yeah. Let's see. What do you get with eBay Enterprise Store? Hey. Hey. Oh, it's your dang, dang lady. <laughs> Gestures. No, no, it's three thousand a month for the enterprise uh, store. Well, I can't afford that. No. I think Linda's paying three thousand a month. Potentially. But she gets a free subscription to therapy. Oh, sweet. $150 at eBay branch. <laughs> it's a lot. $150. That's, That's it. it. They don't even double it. Wow. Wow. How many listings you get at that? 100000 a month? Good Lord. Wow. Hold on, I'm getting a notification. Yeah. <laughs> All right, well, you don't know what's going on. Tommy, do we have an answer about Linda? What's going on? Oh. It's on the phone. I'm oh. all right. He's on the, he's, are you on hold? Oh. He's on hold. <laughs> Can you ask me to refresh our store? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, while you're, while you're talking, while you got her ear. Isn't that what they say? Oh, and they refreshed my store. I'm like, okay. Y'all crazy. Keep refreshing. I'm hungry. We've never had a store refresh. She's investigating. <laughs> Perfect. Oh, man. <laughs> Sal says, Tommy, go live. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, who knew Linda? Tell Tommy who knows Linda. Someone knows Linda. Hello. Um, it was Flippin' Sports Guy. Flippin' Sports Guy. I'll send it to Instagram. Hashtag free Dan. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> All right, y'all. We'll let you know tomorrow night. Tomorrow yeah. Here. That's funny. Doing work. All right. We're going to get some snacks, right? Starting. Let's get some snacks. Thanks for hanging, everybody. We'll see you back here tomorrow. Same time. Same time. Thursday, tomorrow. Bye. Bye.